Hey everybody, welcome to today's video. Now in today's video I want to talk to you about Microsoft Entra and really explain what it is. So let's dive in. So Microsoft Entra was announced in May 2022 and what Microsoft Entra really is is a product family name for Microsoft's existing identity and access management services and some new ones. So in this product family we have a number of elements. The first element that we have is Microsoft Azure Active Directory or Azure AD as it's sometimes known. And this is an existing identity and access management system that I'm sure a few of you are using quite heavily within your organisations already. The second element we have is Permissions Management. Now this is a rename of CloudNock Security and CloudNock Security is a service that Microsoft purchased. With this new renaming of CloudNock Security to Permissions Management, what it really is, is a tool to enforce least privilege access policies across various cloud services. So whether that's Azure, AWS or GCP. One of the things Permission Management's aim to do is detect, automatically right size and continuously monitor unused and excessive permissions within your environment. Now also as part of the Entra family product, we have Verified ID. Now this is also a rebrand. It used to be called Azure AD Verified Credentials, but is now known as Verified ID. This service uses blockchain, electronic ledger and other technologies to create cryptographically secure digital versions of a person's identity. So for example, your driving license or your passport and turning it into a digital version. These are the three main products within the Entra family and we can access those and control them via the Entra admin portal. This is accessed through https colon forward slash forward slash entra dot com and that allows you to interact with those three services that I mentioned Azure AD, Permissions Management and Verified ID. Now there are also two other products that fall under the Entra product family. So we have workload identities and life cycle workflows. Workload identities are non-human identities that allow an application or service principal to access a resource. And we've got the other service, which is life cycle workflows. And this is a new Azure Active Directory identity governance service. It enables organisations to manage Azure AD users by automating the process of having joiners, movers and leavers in your system. So you can schedule it to perform tasks based on certain triggers to help automate onboarding, changing or removing users from your system. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video and you now know a bit more about Microsoft Entra. If you have enjoyed this video, please smash that like button for me and I'll hopefully catch you in another video.